Hello friends, this is Durga again from ITVersity, a one-stop shop to learn all the technologies. At this time we are talking about setting up lab um, uh, uh, for practicing Hadoop and uh, Spark. Uh, as part of this video, I will try to show uh, how to set up prerequisites um, uh, before setting up the single node cluster on uh, uh, one of the servers on the cloud. So w once you log into the cluster, uh, irrespective of the uh, the cloud provider you are using the steps will be same here the usernames might be different the ip addresses might be different and the way you you connect might be little bit different but uh, once you connect the steps going forward are same you do, uh, you can use this on any public cloud provider once you get the instance and connect to it so that being said uh, 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 you don't need to have very deep knowledge uh, as a developer to practice uh, on this lab about the prerequisites you just have to run a script uh, to uh, to perform certain prerequisites those scripts are in my github account i will be providing inline uh, as part of the uh, description uh, in udemy um, otherwise you can go to the github account also so this is my github account you go to hadoop administration you can either go to cloudera or hortonworks go to scripts and there is a uh, prerequisites under setup uh, cluster there is a script called prepare node.sh so this is the path this is the repository name code which have directed hadoop uh, which have directed administration cloudera scripts setup cluster and it has the prepare node sh you can uh, look into these things as we are dealing with only single node either we can um, run each step manually or you can copy into a script and you can run the script so i'll be copying and running as a script so once you open the file here you can just uh, say control a no you should not say control a you just have to copy from first line to last line here and then open nano or va editor and copy that and make sure everything is copied cleanly so it should start with uh, uh, this comment and uh, end with uh, this comment prepare notes complete save it okay and then you have to change the permissions on this file so that you can execute the script and then you can run this script and hit enter so it installs all uh, all the necessary prerequisites to set up the cluster ladder okay so there is some error with respect to the last few lines let me see cat prepare node dot sh Actually, we can remove these things. Vi. I think you don't need to have. So I will fix the script uh, in GitHub. I think there is some uh, issue with it. Yeah, now it worked. Anyway, it's it is complaining that command not found. So the command should look like this: sudo hyphen hyphen sh uh, hyphen c. Okay. So cat prepare. So let me fix that. Vi prepare node dot sh. hyphen hyphen sh minus c i will modify for all the lines so coming out of the script now after making all the modifications i am running this uh, cat command and uh, earlier i have tested for uh, the first one now i will be running mm -hmm. the remaining ones mm -hmm. 
okay so now we it worked well now i want to update the github also so i'm going into github here edit and then replace all these lines with the correct commands okay and then fix security limits portion of the script and commit changes so now i have changed uh, uh, saved the changes in the uh, github also once we make all these prerequisites we have to run init 6 command either by using sudo or without using sudo depending upon what user we have used to log in if it is a non root user you have to use sudo if he is sudo all otherwise you have to log in as root and run this uh, init 6 command so that it can be restarted okay so all these prerequisites has to be executed uh, no need to worry about what these prerequisites are because you you want the environment to be built for the uh, lab for your development practice purposes uh, not for the setup uh, setting up the cluster uh, if you want to set up the cluster i have other courses which you need to follow in it six and the server will be re rebooted uh, in no time so once the server is rebooted uh, as we have set up the prerequisites going forward we can actually start setting up the necessary software uh, to have the lab for us to explore whatever you want to that being said i hope you are enjoying the content on this course if you like this or uh, uh, want to provide the feedback please uh, do so um, and uh, i will try to improvise my uh, content depending upon your feedback uh, and also all the necessary steps will be highlighted as part of the description uh, uh, in udemy as well and uh, uh, finally, if you want to discuss further about Big Data or Hadoop, please join my LinkedIn group called ITVersity-BigData. Uh, if you want to discuss further about certifications in Hadoop, please join my LinkedIn group called ITVersity-Certifications so that we can have uh, um, uh, discussions on uh, those topics. Thank you. Bye.